Live from Studio 5 on Michigan Avenue, this is NBC 5 News Today at 9 a.m. And in this morning's Weekend Web, keeping your children motivated and up to date with technology while learning. Here is NBC 5's Charlie Wojciechowski. Good morning. The kids are back in school. How do you keep them interested, motivated, and help them stay in touch? We've got the high-tech mommy in the studio, Kat hey, Schwartz. Hey, how are you? I am well. How good, are you? Good, good. Thanks for making the trip out. Sure. You've got some great yeah. ideas here. This one, we've seen a lot of webcams. What's special yes. about the Creative This is the one? Creative Quick Cam. This is the newest camera. It allows students to keep in touch with their parents when they're away at school. You can use free services like Skype to talk to them online, but the cool thing about this camera is that you can also do a lot of different things like turn it on a motion detection mode. So if kids are in your dorm room, it can start taking pictures and so email you. So it's a little security you. system. Yes, it is. And you can also put parental control on it. So if you are using it at home with younger kids, you can put it on lockdown so they can't get into trouble. That's a good plan. <laughs> now, with really young kids, you've got a, a really neat product here. Yeah. Tell me about this This guy. is VTech's WizKid PC learning system, and it allows for smart play in two ways. The first is by connecting it to the Internet, which is a hot trend, connecting it so to I the see computer. So, you've got the laptop here, a USB simple connection. Yep. yep, and also you can take it on the go. When it's on the computer, it turns the activity pages into a different three-dimensional type of play. They can go to the WizKid website, and it's contained. It's a safe place for them to play online. They can print out more activity sheets. Parents can keep track of their kids' progress. And these are the sheets right these here. They slide right into the front. hundred different activities. Yeah, they just you open it up like this. A hundred different activities. Your child's not going to get bored, and that's why I like this device. All right. Now, now we got a couple of more things for kids who yes. like to sleep. This yes. is an iPod uh, here. Uh, yeah, this What's is, kind of they the like to sleep through class, right? Yeah, the, okay. like, like I did, sleep so, through the lectures. Right, so this device right here is actually a, um, it's a microphone, and it turns your teacher's lecture into an MP3 file, where is it, here we go, Slide. Onto, yeah. the, uh, onto the iPod, so you can then record and turns it into an MP3 file, so when you're working out later, you can listen, or, you know, if you slept, you can reiterate what happened through your iPod. And to learn more about these things, you have a website yes. set up? It is called hightechmommy.com. Go there, all the info's there. Wonderful catch once. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Of course, if you can't remember that, remember us. We are NBC5.com. We'll put a link to the High Tech Mommy right there. Also, check out our page called Open Access. That's for Chicago's disabled community. For the Vacation Art Roman, I'm Charlie Voice and Husky, and we'll see you right here next weekend. I love that segment. I'm gonna look it up. 927 coming up in our next half.